Hey guys, it's TTL back with another rush kit for you. Now this has literally just got through the door and uh, I thought I would jump on it really quickly because there's obviously a lot of hype around the RX 480s at the moment where they've only just released. Yesterday at the time of making this video was when I, was, uh, when I put all the other stuff live. So this is the new XFX Black Edition card. Now this is their top of the range one which comes with a 1326 megahertz boost. And on overclockers at the moment, it's uh, basically 240 quid. They do do another one with a slightly lower clock for 200, and, uh, I think it's around 225, 230 quid. But anyway, there is a cheaper one than the one with the uh, big, big overclock. I think it runs, that one runs at about 280 some, uh, 1280 something megahertz. They both look relatively the same though. So when we bring it in, you're thinking to yourself, oh, it's a reference card, Tom. We've seen this. And to be honest with you, on that respect, you have seen this. But the special bit about the XFX cards, and it's the bit that even I've been surprised about, is the backplate. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, it's a backplate, Tom. That's not special. But to be honest with you, I would have expected the backplate to have stopped there on the back of the card. But they've carried it the rest of the way down the card and there's a little rubber shield around the outside so that when the fan does spin it just pulls air from uh, outside and it doesn't start pulling all the hot air across now it may only be a really small thing but that has really impressed me because when you have it in a system it's I know the um, PCI Express connector is here but optically from the top it is going to make it look like a longer bigger card and there's no big steps or anything like that and I really like the look of that. So here's how the reference card looks in our test system. You can obviously see the PCB, you can see there's a distinct difference at the top with the end of the cooler. Don't think it looks that great to be honest with you. Put the XFX in there though and I think that instantly looks a million times better. I have got the light on the side just to try and give it a bit of but you can see that you've got all the little dimples on the top and that back plate going to the edge is brilliant. I know you've still got this here, but I'm sure the, the cabling masters out there will be able to get it looking nice. That's if you've even got a window in your case. Now we will be doing a full review on this because obviously it's got a big hefty overclock, but this is just a little teaser for you to let you have a look at it before I get into the review process. We do have an awful lot of stuff in a backlog at the moment, but I will try and get this done as quickly as I possibly can for you, and you will see it on the main channel. But if you think this is the uh, RX 480 for you, then you can get it on overclockers. Also, just to finish off, we are actually giving one of these away, thanks to the boys at XFX and overclockers. I will put the link underneath for you so that you can go and enter the competition. And uh, yeah, good luck with that, peeps. For now at least, this is Tony Tom Logan, with another video for you, out.